This is an overview of Finance Manager version 6 for Hyper-V with dynamic optimization. Finance Manager for Hyper-V is an easy to use and cost effective management solution for Microsoft Hyper-V. It provides most of the features of Microsoft System Center Virtual Machine Manager that small and medium businesses need for everyday life Hyper-V management. Finance Manager for Hyper-V allows to dramatically simplify and save money on Hyper-V management, get a user-friendly management GUI interface for Windows Server Core and Microsoft Hyper-V Server, manage different Hyper-V versions and clusters from a single console, and improve resource usage with dynamic optimization. Let's have a look at Finance Manager version 6 for Hyper-V in action. As you know, high availability is very important to maintain business continuity. For this, you set up a cluster and Finance Manager allows you to manage it directly from Finance Manager for Hyper-V console. So once you've added the cluster, you can see all the nodes and all the virtual machines present on these nodes. To create a high available virtual machine, you just need to right-click on that and select Add to Cluster option. This will make virtual machine high available and you don't have to go to any other settings. If you want to put it back into non-high available state, you just right-click again on that and select Remove from Cluster. As you have to be able to perform maintenance tasks on your cluster nodes, we've implemented pause and resume options with or without training roles from your cluster nodes. This allows you to completely move out virtual machines from your cluster node to perform hardware upgrade, an example. Another very important functionality available in Define Manager is live migration support. You can live migrate virtual machines directly between cluster nodes and to do that you just select move option and either best possible node or a node that you want to have virtual machine on. By the way, best possible node is calculated by Hyper-V according to the available memory. We can see the progress of live migration and status of that in a task log as well as all other management tasks that you perform in Final Manager for Hyper-V. To access that, you just click in the bottom right corner of the window just on the status bar. When you work with multiple virtual machines, obviously you want to create new ones even faster. So for this, we've implemented clone and export functionality that allows you to perform clones of virtual machines for future use. If your virtual machine is sysprepped, it means it becomes a golden template and you can create as many virtual machines out of that as you need in a few minutes. All the time-consuming tasks can be put into background and monitored in task log of Finance Manager. Being able to connect to a virtual machine in any circumstances is very important during Hyper-V management. To do that, we provide you with options to connect via guest console or via RDP connection in case RDP client is available locally on the system. Guest consoles are also very robust because of a combination of two of them that you can leverage. If you go to View Options menu, you can see free RDP and Microsoft-based client. These clients allow you to be confident about your ability to connect to a virtual machine without network connection, no matter what. Smart sizing option allows you to fit guest console windows without scroll bars into your screen. Since replication has been a great improvement since Hyper-V 2012, we are constantly giving you information about replication health but what even more important, you can also generate notifications according to system events that include virtual machine replication failure notification in case one of the processes goes wrong. That is especially important if you plan your disaster recovery purely based on Hyper-V replica and you have to know in case something goes wrong. That is available within Final Manager for Hyper-V. System status report 
provides you with information about your Hyper-V host and about virtual machine's configuration on that host. That is very handy when you have to keep information for future reference or whenever you have to share that with your customer. Best Practices Analyzer is a built-in Microsoft MBPA tool that allows you to check if your system corresponds to Microsoft's best practices in Hyper-V configuration. Hyper-V logs allow you to view all the events related to Hyper-V in one single tab. That really saves you time on going through Microsoft Event Log to check what is happening with your Hyper-V system at the moment. Optimizer tab stands for dynamic optimization of your workload across your Hyper-V infrastructure. To add dynamic optimization to your cluster, just press Add, create a host group, Once required hosts are added to a dynamic optimization group, you can see resource utilization on a graph below. Virtual machines will start moving from one node to another once resource utilization becomes high on one of the nodes. This corresponds to performance thresholds that you specify, and this can be individual for each of your hyper nodes, and settings allow you to justify the aggressiveness of virtual machine migrations. In this particular case, in case threshold is met for 600 seconds with performance counter interval of 20 seconds, virtual machines will start moving around to optimize the load of your Hyper-V infrastructure. That takes out a necessity for you to monitor and view your infrastructure in real time and optimize it manually. Dynamic optimization does the job for you so you can relax and keep working on your new projects within your infrastructure. Dynamic optimization is very important to maintain a high level of service for your virtual machines without any manual operations. Download Finance Manager version 6 for Hyper-V and start using it today.